Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rocio and I am so happy that you are here. So today I have a very special video for you guys. I'm very excited about this one. I partnered with Sarah B to bring you guys how I've been managing my skin, my acne prone skin to be specific, using the Acne Foaming Cream Cleanser and the Resurfacing Retinol Serum. CeraVe is developed with dermatologists and their acne products actually help promote a clear complexion with less irritation while helping maintain and restore the skincare barrier with three essential ceramides which are highly highly important especially for us acne prone folks a little bit about my skin I've been dealing with acne since I was 16 I am now 27 so it's been a long journey full with a bunch of trials and errors especially with my skincare. I've gone through so many different cleansers. I've gone to dermatologists. I've taken oral medication. I've had topical creams. I've about had it all. And it can be very frustrating. So if you're dealing with acne, I know how you feel. The type of acne that I get are really painful, cystic, big pimples. They're planets. And it can be very frustrating and again, very, very painful. And like I've said, I've gone through so many different products. And so then when day I stumbled upon a post from one of my mutuals her name is makeup for women of color um aka tiara that's her name i love her so much she's an amazing esthetician you can find her on twitter and on instagram and she raved a lot about V, especially the healing ointment which i will get to later on in this video but one day she mentioned the acne foaming cream cleanser which has four percent benzo peroxide and i was like four percent benzo peroxide and you can get it in stores and I don't have to get it over the counter. I was really like, whoa, and it's a cream foaming cleanser. Like it's hydrating, but it also is foaming. I was really, really intrigued by it. And when she mentioned it, it actually sold out on Amazon. So I had to go look for it in CVS and I did find it. And once it came back in stock on Amazon, I literally bought a backup. So I'm already done with my first bottle. Literally, I squeezed all of it out and that is what has been helping maintain my acne you guys i cannot live without that cleanser at all like i said i've gone to the dermatologist and i've been prescribed benzoyl peroxide um cleansers and they are so drying and they irritated my skin even more they were just way too strong and this acne foaming cream cleanser is just not that at all so before i wash my face i always clean my hands please make sure that your hands are clean you don't want to go put bacteria on your skin so please wash your hands the acne foaming cream cleanser contains 4% benzoyl peroxide which helps clear acne and prevents new acne while allowing the skin to heal I really love this cleanser because it's so gentle sometimes benzoyl peroxide like I said can be very drying it used to dry me out especially the ones that the dermatologist would prescribe me but this does not make my skin feel that way hence creamy cleanser foaming creamy cleanser it has this really hydrating creamy consistency which helps to solve dirt and excessive oil without stripping the skin of its natural oil which is important this also has three essential ceramides which maintain and protect the skin barrier the skin barrier is really really important and it has one of my favorite skincare ingredients which is hyaluronic acid and hyaluronic acid attracts hydration to the face and it helps the skin retain its moisture i've been using it i want to say for the past like two or three months maybe three months and it's really been like a lifesaver okay so here is the finish face after i washed my face with the acne foaming cream cleanser and it doesn't feel drying at all i actually feel really hydrated i look really hydrated i just know i do so quick story little little small story about the resurfacing retinol serum so this is my first time well it's not my first time with retinol i've used it before with like my dermatologist but i've never got the results that i wanted until i use this so i have um Melia, I always say it wrong, and I had it on my forehead. You'll, I'll put up the like before and after photos, cause you'll, you'll see it on my forehead. Like it's like a really big one that I had. 
Um, and uh, when I started using the resurfacing retinol serum, I noticed that the milia started to come to the surface. And now retinol helps with milia if you have it. And so one day when I was laying in bed, I like went like this and it popped out and I like got up and I ran to the restroom and I washed it because I didn't want it to get infected and I don't have it anymore you probably can't see it but in the photos you'll see like that I don't have it any longer so I just wanted to mention that I just feel like I'm actually seeing results from it and I'm very happy about it so this is CeraVe's resurfacing retinol serum it's an encapsulated retinol I really like that because it's very enclosed it has a pump if you guys can see and it helps reduce the appearance of post acne marks and pores I have really giant pores from all the years of like popping my pimples which please do not do just don't do it I know you want to do it but don't do it and it helps improve the texture on your skin which I've been noticing man if you go look at my makeup page which is Rocio Seha underscore you'll see that my acne looks smoother and my foundation applies better it's very gentle on the skin I'm actually gonna go ahead and put it so what I do is just one pump that's all you need you do not need more and what I like to do is I'll actually like Pick it up with my middle finger i'm not flipping you guys off um and i'll dot it around my face i avoid my under eyes you don't want to put this around your eyes at all retinol could be a little drying this one i really like because it's for anyone who has really sensitive skin i'm gonna start massaging that in and what i like about the serum is that it's really lightweight it feels so silky on the skin and smooth like, I'm about to just fall asleep right here. No, I'm just kidding. This is also formulated with the three essential ceramides, which again helps to restore the protective skin barrier. Also, this has another one of my favorite ingredients, which is niacinamide. That actually helps soothe and calm your skin. It's also non-comedogenic. I can never say that word right. I'm so sorry. I'll put it up here. It's paraben-free and it's fragrance-free, which... Things that are fragrance free make me really happy because fragrance can be pretty irritating, potentially be irritating to people who have acne prone skin. Maybe not to everyone, but it definitely can be irritating to my skin. So I like fragrance free skincare over here. Now, another thing that I wanna mention, I use the retinol once only at night. I don't really wear retinol in the day, but if you do, please, 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 wear spf it's really really important that you wear spf no matter what even if you don't decide to use a retinol and you don't decide to use a retinol on monday i don't know just wear spf it's really important which is going to lead me to the am facial moisturizing lotion before i go into my pm facial moisturizing lotion i know that was a long that was a lot so the am facial moisturizing lotion has sunscreen it has a broad spectrum of spf 30. i love this spf i've been using it every single day since i bought it this one is also oil free and it's fragrance free like i said i like my stuff fragrance free it's also non-comedogenic <laughs> I'm gonna be saying it so softly and quietly because I'm gonna be messing it up. And the formula will not clog your pores. I'm very happy that it does not clog my pores at all. It also has the three essential ceramides and it also includes niacinamide and hyaluronic acid. Two very important skincare ingredients for me. And the most important is it's very moisturizing. It helps restore the protective skincare barrier. This one compared to the PM moisturizer is a little bit thicker and that's just because it's a spf so please always remember to use spf it's not a joke it also can help with hyperpigmentation like really preventing that so wear your spf every day i'm gonna tell you guys wear your spf okay now moving on to the CeraVe pm facial moisturizing lotion so this moisturizer is ultra lightweight versus the am moisturizer which is a little bit thicker and of course it has spf in it this one is also oil free and it will not clog up your pores i like to take two pumps of this because i just like to be very moisturized this one also has the three essential ceramide well again and it has hyaluronic acid which helps retain the skin's natural moisture and it has niacinamide which i love again like i said it helps soothe and calm your skin i like to press in my moisturizer like this 
Ew. This moisturizer works overnight to hydrate your skin. I'm gonna take just a little bit more because you don't want to forget your neck ever. Don't forget your neck. That includes with SPF, you guys. Don't forget to put SPF on your neck. And you also always want to moisturize after you use retinol. It's so important. Like I said, retinol can be a little bit drying. So if you're prone to that, make sure you always moisturize afterwards. Now last, but certainly not least, is CeraVe's Healing Ointment. This is my baby. Oh my gosh. I've had this bottle for quite a while. Like it's, you do not need a lot. That's why. So basically the healing ointment to me is a last layer that i put on to protect my skin from everything else like my environment and stuff and also to lock in everything that i have in this is really really great for people who have really 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 dry skin i have acne prone skin but i also have really dry patches um, around my skin especially when I would get like any little pimples in those areas I would always be really dry so it was always really important for me to find something that would help with that also when you're breaking out it's really great to have this because it heals like your acne as well it also helps with like your scars and stuff now this has petroleum in it and hyaluronic acid and again the most important it has ceramides in it it's also fragrance free remember what I said about fragrance I don't need it and what I really like about it is because I get so much redness uh, it really helps fight that and it calms my irritation so again you only need a pea size you guys this is a petroleum like it's it's very like moisturizing you know so you don't need a lot and this one again makeup for women of color Tierra was the one that put me on and I never go a day without it and it's so bomb you guys I just put it all over my skin and that is literally the last step of my skincare routine again put this on your neck you never not want to bring your skincare down to your neck and your chest too so I feel so good right now I sleep like a baby okay so I've zoomed you in and this is my Base. I feel really great about it. I feel very moisturized. She's looking real cute. And if you guys see the before and after of my photos, you'll see that my chin area. She gets really red, but she's definitely recovered from the first photo to now, and I'm very happy about that. It's been about two months. Yeah, two months since I've had really big cystic acne and that is think to this routine that i have now which of course includes acne foaming cream cleanser and the retinol resurfacing serum i am very very happy about my skin like i still break out like little pimples here and there um and you'll see on the side of my cheek right here but like i'm just so happy that it's not really really big massive ones and i found something that i can manage my acne with um so i'm very happy about that and i hope that you guys enjoyed this video one last thing if you want to enter to win all these products a good old sweepstake i will leave the link in the description down below and you can enter all you need to do is enter your name your email and your birthday and you can get a chance to win all these products thank you to my partner sarah v for sponsoring this video i'm really really grateful because i really genuinely love the brand and i really do believe in their products and they're affordable i forgot to mention that they're affordable how it's like how did I not mention that? They're so affordable, you guys. You can get them at CVS, at Walgreens, or on Amazon. If you have Prime, you could get free shipping. And yeah, that's about it. Don't forget to enter the sweepstake if you want to win again. All the products that I use will be in the description down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye, guys.